Without a pack, her days could still be numbered. In Jurassic Park, the fleet-footed Velociraptor raced out of nowhere to become one of the world's most famous dinosaurs. However, Velociraptor was actually less than one half my size. Scientists used to think dinosaurs resembled lizards, but now we see them as more akin to birds. In 1999, paleontologists digging in China discovered a new species of dinosaur with a revolutionary feature. It has a layer of primitive feathers up to an inch and a half long. Thriving about 135 million years ago, Cynornithosaurus is one of the earliest known bird-like dinosaurs. Yet it couldn't fly, so why was it feathered? Possibly to help control body temperature, or perhaps to attract members of the opposite sex. 55 million years later, along came another flightless carnivore, Velociraptor. Besides feathers, Velociraptor and Cynornithosaurus share more than a hundred specialized features with birds, including the hollow bones that help make birds airborne. Based on this mountain of evidence, both of these predatory dinosaurs support the idea that birds are the direct descendants of two-legged meat-eating dinosaurs. We still don't know exactly why feathers evolved, but we do know if it looks like a bird and acts like a bird, it must be a dinosaur.